Yeah, it was a dream come true for sure. You know, I wasn't expecting to go to a Division One school that's top 30 in the nation. And uh, it's great that they gave me an amazing scholarship. You know, I'll be playing number three in the spot. But obviously, you know, I'm going to be taking a gap here, continuing my professional career. And I'm going to be playing on the ATP circuit in Italy and all over Europe. But when in North Bay, Catahan will be hitting and getting some coaching from his old friend, Francois Rockman. Let's give him some options. I know I'm not 100% familiar with the, with the college rules and the university rules for the, in, uh, in the States. But there, there has been a small change where they are able to play some uh, uh, professional tournaments and then still be eligible for uh, scholarships and, and college and university tennis in the States. Now, some tennis players have had to practice in hotel rooms because of the lockdown. Catahan has done that, too. He's looking forward, though, to getting to play again after a very, well, strange year in a bit. It has been, yes. Yeah. So, you know, obviously I've been talking to many coaches of my team, you know, just staying fit as possible, you know, staying active. And I'm obviously I was training in my coach's garage for a little bit to get my rhythm back and hitting ones of balls, a bunch of balls. So, you know, that helped a lot. Well, it's funny because I've seen pro players like practicing in their hotel rooms. I mean, teams or players have had to do a lot of different things during this. Yeah, that's true. That's absolutely true. And I was actually one of them that was actually doing that as well while I was playing tournaments. And then obviously it got canceled. And then, you know, I had to quarantine for two weeks. So it, was a little bit of a, it sucked a little bit, but, you know, obviously I just stay positive about it.